Okie dokie. Now, off we go back to whatever his name is. Got some of these names. Don't they have normal names? But hey, who has normal names these days? Heathen. Watch it, witch hunter. Need to chat. I'm all ears with you. What I'm saying? Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Oh. Oi, lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Come. better. Alright, what do you have for me? Max Brasoli's house, as requested. The papers, where are they? Left them in the vault. You wanted the house, you got the house. Never mentioned its contents. You're a quick study. Already as tricky as Odin himself. Keen to ridicule a man. Do you know what I and the company do with your type? Dunno. Ask for legal advice? Looks to me like you might need some. You signed the contract, Old Geard. I'm just fulfilling its terms, to the letter. Unhappy? Hell, should have chosen your words more carefully. Yes, I should have. I assume you came to an agreement with Horst. Shame. A right horse in that one. Eh, not exactly. Made a deal with his brother, who then beat the living shit out of Horst with a gold candle holder. Huh. It's progress. The Borsodis. What's your gripe? Get kicked out of an auction? Worse. They evicted me from my home. Are you really interested? Yeah. Wouldn't have asked if I wasn't. Ha! <laughs> Cheeky as ever. <laughs> my family. They took on some debt. A poor investment in a sawmill. A bad crop one year. A lawsuit lost. You know how it is. When it rains, it pours. Yeah. We needed but a few weeks to recover. But Horst Borsodi had acquired our debt. All of it. Demanded it be repaid immediately. I pleaded. I begged. I tore open my shirt at his threshold. Ugh. Like talking to a wall. I went to the auction, saw those perfumed pricks by my father's sword, my mother's death mask, my brother's horse tack. Ah, horse turned a pretty pile selling our mementos. No surprise the animosity you feel for him. That was for the start. My Iris's parents learned of my family's misfortune, and our betrothal was no more. They found her another suitor. One from beyond the sea. 
the anger I felt. I thought I'd gone mad. Went to the tavern, drank around, a second, a broad, then had another tankard. And then, then, I asked the wrong bloke for help. What happened then? Uh, what happened then, Witcher, was one big stinking pile of shite. Well, why do you stand there? Do you need something still? Third wish. Time you stated it. A moment, Geralt. I must say to something. Then we'll chat. You there. Yank the herring out the barrel. this dallying. Now, ready to listen? Or do you still not give two shites about what I've got to say? I'm ready. I'm listening. Good. You'll return to your lord and tell him as follows. His demand was brazen. Hurt me to the core. For I was brought up to respect the sacred law of hospitality. And I shall not bend to an uncouth boar's dictum. Understood. I will pay him a visit shortly to test his willingness to adapt. So you ride off and announce me. And don't spare your horse. Got it? Aye, got it. Give this man a mount and leave him go. Come with you. We must talk outside. Damn, souls made somebody mad. The Afiri believe one should only discuss important matters out of doors, with the gods as witnesses. Hmm. Fulfilled two of your wishes. Time I learned the third. Confident, aren't you? Proud, sure of your strengths. Fearless. Third task, if you don't mind. Mutations. They stripped you of emotion. Tell me, have you ever loved? I mean, truly loved. Yeah, I've loved. Can we get to the matter at hand? Perhaps instead we ought to sit down inside. Have a good chat over some fiery water. <laughs> we'll drink once the job's done. Afraid that's impossible. Succeed and that's the end of me. Fail and you'll not be back. Third wish. Still waiting to hear it. Why? Aren't you stubborn? Fine. Listen well. I had a wife once. The day I saw her last, I gave her a rose. A violet one. Bring me that blue. Wouldn't mind reminding myself what it looks like. <sighs> when was that? How long's it been? Flowers wilted and turned to dust by now. You wished to hear a wish. Now you are. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this dullness. But one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. Another impossible task. At least you could tell me where your wife is. In my old manor, east of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you God speed, but, well, you understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. Expect. Your 
Choked to death on three pounds of steel. All right. So we'll see what this is all about. Somehow we have to get the rose back, but it's probably long gone. Kendrick! Kendrick! Mighty rusty and covered in creepers need another way in. Anyone there? Oh, yeah. Kendrick! Kendrick! You there? Not so loud. Ah! Oh, God, scared me off to... Not so loud, I said. Fog's not natural. Could be something in there hiding. Foglets or air nymphs, for example. Don't want to attract them, believe me. F F Foglets? Oh, sweet mother, my little why not I ever come here? Question. Good question. What are you doing here? See, Kendrick and me, we thought man has been empty all these years, full of fine things, going to rot. And... Mm -hmm. So you're a thief? Thief steal from the living? What's the arm taking from the dead? Kendrick went to open the door. I stood watch. Suddenly heard his lamp smash. And nothing. Quiet. Called out to him, but... What? What, what was that? One of them foglets you spoke of? No. Phew. That's a stone off my... I'll see what that was and look for your partner. You... I ain't about to wait around. I'm out of here. Smart. Pretty sprawling, this estate. How am I gonna find that rose in this fog? Someone's still tending to the flower beds. No violet rose, though. Fresh manure. Hmm. Oh, I get it. Whatever's patrolling his estates, he's gonna kill me. Water's ice cold. Mountain stream cold. Rather worn. Used often. Wonder by who. Alrighty. A busted lamp, and the grounds trampled. Somebody dragged something this way. A body? Someone dragged a wounded man through here. Prints from cleated boots, leading from the back of the garden. Hmm. 
fat cat with uncanny eyes. I'd scooch along, kitty. This place. What's that? That digging. A lockpick? Must have been the other thieves. Okay. thief. Bodies mutilated. Who are you? What are you? Damn. How you like that silver? Taking the Mickey. Guess I'm gonna my gear me a battle done for that. Alright, people, place your bets. Switch oil. I'm thinking that one.
guy.
shit you do, huh? Well, hey, peeps. No eyes or nostrils, deformed organs. Damn thing had no right to be alive. Well, philosophers do still debate what it means to be alive, exactly. Normally I'd be shocked, but not after what I just saw. Who are you two? Clearly not animals. Think of us as friends of the house. You know the master of the house, the owner? Olgird von Everick. Yes, we know him, but he left, and his wife became mistress of the house. Great. So, Lady von Everick home? Could you announce me, say she has a guest? Why do you wish to see her? I'm here to get the violet rose Olgir gave Iris just before he left. Iris is inside, in the bedchamber upstairs. Take his key. It opens the rear door. Guess I'll make my own introductions. Alright, peeps, and that episode went on a little bit longer, because that boss... Damn, he's annoying. But, anyway, we'll catch you all in the next one. Later.